This is the Ant Queen Messer Structor, and for now, she is alone, she has no workers, but soon we will fix that. And this is a mysterious box in which there is something that this ant will like. Let's open it and get what's inside. This package was on its way to me for a couple of days, and it's finally here. Oh, yes. These are ant eggs, and in this small test tube, there are 100 fresh future ants. So well, it seems like all the eggs are in good condition. So it's time to give it to our queen. I think she's been waiting for this her whole life. Because to give birth to such a large number of worker ants, it would take her hundreds of days or even months. And here we will have a large colony in just a couple of days. And it's incredible. Oh my god. Why is she attacking her home? Look, she's moving a giant test tube to the side that is a couple of dozen times bigger than her. This is a real mutant and not an ant queen, but later she will do something that will shock me even more. And now the queen saw a bunch of eggs, and decided not to waste time, and take her eggs to the nest. In front of her a bunch of eggs! Of course she is shocked by such real magic, and she immediately noticed a large number of her future servants, and slowly but surely approaches, takes one egg with her claws, as if it were the most valuable in the world, and carries it into the test tube. The next day. There is already real life in the test tube. The queen has transferred all the eggs there. There are a lot of eggs, and it is noticeable that they have already darkened. This means that very soon the first workers will begin to appear. But there is one problem. The test tube has already become cramped. She simply does not have enough space. The nest is full. So I decided, time to settle them in a new home. This is a wonderful ant farm with an arena and nest chambers. In a few days, there will be hundreds of ants running around here, and they will attack everything that comes their way. I think this is the perfect nest to start a colony. And now I'm going to add some water here to prepare the ant hill. I put a test tube in the middle of the arena and leave some time for the queen to fill the new space herself. I carefully open the test tube and carefully pour the queen along with the eggs into the center of the arena. She is a little shocked, but she can't get used to it anymore. The queen started running around like crazy, not understanding what was happening. Poured some seeds for them to eat, but that didn't calm her down. She wanted to run away from here. Oh my god, what is she doing? I carefully put her back to her eggs and decided to close the lid on this anthill. Until she calmed down, later she took the eggs to the middle of the nest. And everything seems to be calm. Look what a nice place. And then I noticed that the queen started unpacking the first worker ant. Every day there were more and more ants. No, even every hour the queen was spawning five to ten new workers. Later I wanted to give them a little bit of one insect to eat, since it is a good protein for the development of the colony. When I put this locust in the middle of the ant hill, nothing happened. Were the ants really not hungry? Maybe they have some kind of diet, and they decided to become vegetarians? Hmm. And then after a while, I noticed that my cat was looking at the ants for a long time. But why? And then I saw that not only ants live there. Oh my god. It's a larva. The queen has been shocked for the third time today. All the workers started running away from this terrible larva. But not our queen. She desperately started actively fighting the larva. She went out into the ring. And immediately on your screens, we see that the queen is making her way forward. The larva is going on the defensive, but our giant ant will not leave her just like that. And started fighting the larva for her eggs. This is something incredible. Look at what an epic confrontation. The queen will never give up her nest for this impudent insect that has invaded her kingdom. Many days have passed since the creation of a large ant colony. But what about the new offering? Ooh, just look at this. What cute ant egg. These are future ants. And soon they will hatch and there will be new workers. And here is a giant soldier who will protect the colony in the future. And also with his powerful claws to gnaw hard seeds. Since this type of ant feeds on them. They mainly live in steppes and dry areas and feed mainly only on seed. By collecting them, ants turn their anthill into a real underground 
underground warehouse, they drag the seeds to the nest, store them in special chambers, and grind some of them into a kind of a porridge and bread. Thank you for watching. See you soon.